Hi, in this screencast we're going to talk about how to compose an actual web page using the nested tables, uh, HTML tables, I mean. Uh, because there are a lot to cover in this screencast, so I'm not going to do the actual coding. Instead, I'm just going to show you a page that I've created and explain what to do and how to do it. Okay. Uh, some, some notes that I want to um, iterate before I get started. Uh, some attributes I've used in the HTML file may be unfamiliar, unfamiliar to you, uh, so uh, don't just skip it. Okay, uh, Try to learn more about it by searching online. Okay, uh, Second thing is the reason why I used nested table uh, was to overcome the limitation of matching columns within each row. You know that uh, if you have a table that has uh, three columns in first row, you cannot have just two columns in the second row. So uh, if you want to have a row that has a few columns, a second row with different columns, uh, do a nested table. That, that means to have a table inside the cell and create more columns in that table. So it won't interfere with uh, the outer table rows. I'll show you what I mean. And uh, another reason why I did uh, nested tables, uh, well, demonstrate nested table is um, for a reason. I want to show you how everything was done before CSS came out. Okay, so let's get started here. I have a nested table layout uh, folder. Okay, the file structure is like this: the HTML file, and then I have an images folder that contains all the images that I'll need for this web page. And uh, building a web page is like piecing together a puzzle. Okay, you piece together all the uh, images to make it look like a page. Okay, and I'll show you what I mean by that. Let's look at the index.html in our browser. And it looks like this. It's actually just one of the pages in uh, OG Solution. Okay. And you can see that we have uh, the header part, okay, the uh, menu, the top menu, the left menu, the middle column, and the right column, right? and then at the bottom the footer right okay so uh, think of this as one big table you have the top row second row third row and the final row okay which is the footer row okay and within e these rows you have uh, another table inside this one row okay that has three columns Okay, and then second row you have another table that has three columns. Okay, then uh, in the third row you have another table that has one, two, three columns. Same with the bottom row. Okay, and that's what I mean by nested rows, uh, nested tables. I'm going to show you the source of this page. Open with. We're going to use a top style 